In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to play Genshin Impact with controller on Android. It's a very quick and easy process, so make sure to follow along. All you need to play Genshin Impact with a controller on your Android phone is the latest version of the Genshin Impact game. So make sure to update it properly through the Play Store or the App Store. And after you ensure that you are properly updated and running the latest version, the second thing you need is to connect your controller to your Android device. You can do so before or after opening up Genshin Impact. The order doesn't matter as long as the controller is properly set up. So either connect it through a USB port on your phone or you can also use Bluetooth for most controllers. Make sure Bluetooth is enabled and that your device is paired up or synced up properly. Afterwards, you may notice that when we open up Genshin Impact, it, it defaults to touch screen controllers. All we have to do is to click on the Paimon icon on the top left corner of the screen, go into the settings, go into the controls settings and change the control type, the first option from touch screen to controller. As you can see, I don't have the option because I don't have a controller connected, but as long as your controller is properly set up and connected to your Android device, it's gonna be listed under touch screen. And after you select controller, you will be able to play and do everything in Genshin Impact using your controller. I hope I was able to help you on how to play Genshin Impact with controller on Android. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more quick and easy tips. Thank you for watching.